On this day, 70 years ago, WHSV hit the airwaves as the first TV news station in the Shenandoah Valley. And while much has changed since October 19th, 1953, our commitment to serving the community has remained the same. Let's take a look back on how our station became what it is today. WHSV TV3 Harrisonburg. Before we were WHSV, Harrisonburg's first TV news broadcast went on air on October 19th, 1953 as WSVA TV. We did everything by hand. I think the computer came into being probably in the late 60s, early 70s, somewhere along in there. But uh, it, was, it was just a totally different world. The first newscast made possible after engineers carved a path up a big mountain to install the first transmitting tower. I can't help but think of a photo that I've seen of the very first engineers and they were near a pickup truck and the bed was full of dead rattlesnakes that they had killed while they did their work. These people were not only pioneers for WHSV, they were pioneers in every regard. And since then, six towers have been installed, allowing us to reach homes across the Shenandoah Valley and into West Virginia. Good evening, everyone. I'm Bob Corso. And I'm Jamie Caron. For 70 years, you've welcomed us into your living rooms. Good evening, I'm Kayla Brooks. And I'm Chelsea Church. Glad you're with us. Making We're us part of your daily routine. Some of the faces that you've gotten to know have come and gone, but there are a few that became household names. I guess I stayed at TV3 because it seemed like every couple of years I was doing something new. You know, it didn't, it didn't get stagnant at all to me. I enjoyed what I was doing and enjoyed the challenges of informing uh, the viewers about what was going on locally. Over the last seven decades, we've been there with you through the good times. Happy birthday, Grandma. Oh, man. Oh, Z makes it look, look easy, it. doesn't he? And through the bad. They say that they heard several gunshots, four to five today. The water just rushing down the street like nobody has ever seen. Alerting you first, keeping you informed, and being a news source you can trust through it all. If something needs to get out to our community, if we need to tell people to shelter in place or evacuate or be on the lookout for something, we can trust that WHSV is going to help us get that information out. And while the way we cover and report the news has changed over the years as technology has evolved, the staff at WHSV has remained committed to serving you. The thing I love the most, I think, about this TV station is that we give our best every single day. No matter what corner of the building people are working in, people care immensely about this television station and immensely about this community that we serve. And the community that we live in. I grew up in this area and so um, from the time that I was a little kid, when we talked about TV, uh, we were talking about WHSV. We're working hard to serve this community and I think because we've done that for 70 years now, we've developed a relationship with the members of the community. We support them and in turn they support us. And each year our staff looks for new opportunities to grow and ways to give back. Whether that's a blanket drive, a toy drive, the end zone program that we do this time of the year for our high school football team, whether that's a job fair, something like that. We are so much more than the six o'clock news. We are in this community 24 seven, on air, off air, working hard for you. 70 years. It's, it's crazy incredible. to think about. I mean, I've been here for four years and already so much has happened in mm -hmm. that time span. So it was really neat to be able to go back and look through all the old photos and all the old videos and seeing that highlight reel of Bob Corso. It was so it was really awesome. Yeah. No, it is. And it's awesome just to hear from everybody who's come and gone or has been here for so right. long and is still here. It's so great to hear everybody's experiences. Yeah, well, definitely happy to be working hard for you. We will be continuing to be working hard for you, hopefully for 70 more years. So, all right.